Blackpool owner Owen Oyston wants to remove son Carl as the club's chairman. A family feud has evolved after a court order to pay an estranged club president, the Oyston family, O. Valerie Bellicon, £31 million for unfair prejudice financial circumstances surrounding case may force Owen to relinquish control be Jack Gorkin for Mail Online published, 1755 Eastern Standard Time, 30 January 2018, updated, 1804 Eastern Standard Time, 30 January 2018 Carl Oyston's grip on Blackpool is hanging by a thread amid an escalating family feud following their humiliation in court. Sportsmail understands Blackpool owner Owen Oyston wants to remove son Carl as chairman, a decision taken in the aftermath of being ordered to pay estranged club president Valerie Bellicon £31 million for unfair prejudice. The first £10 million of that sum was paid last month, with the next £10 million instalment due on Wednesday, with Bellicon ready to find out whether the Oystons have managed to raise those funds. Carl Oyston's center grip on Blackpool is hanging by a thread amid an escalating family feud. The family, labeled asset strippers in the High Court, were dealt a significant blow earlier in the week when the Court of Appeal denied permission to lodge an appeal against ruling. Sources present at Bloomfield Road for the postponed League One fixture against Charlton on Saturday claimed to have heard choice words between owner and chairman. Owen Oyston has insisted he is the right man to lead the Seasiders forward, but the financial circumstances surrounding the Bellicon case may force him to relinquish control. It's understood the 84-year-old's daughter Natalie, Carl's half-sister, could step in to become chairwoman in the interim. Carl has recently left his role in more than 10 family businesses. The developments will embolden Bellicon, who has always maintained he wants to take control of Blackpool. Both Carl and Owen Oyston refused to comment when contacted by Sportsmail. It is understood owner Owen Oyston, right, wants to remove his son as chairman of the club.